But now I can go back to Gremlin. And then when I find our third enemy... Because by going through this... Where was it? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, Alistair is for some reason right between Skull Million and the Beam Skeleton. When it's not found in the arena at all. Uh, Demon Lord right next to Flame Demon and Final Guard. And of course, the final enemy should be coming up soon. Uh, that's Final Guard. Also, I think in many of the Chaos Rooms, maybe not many of the Chaos Rooms, but... I think there are items in there in horror mode. Ah, uh, I really wish I had, you know, played through this ahead of time just to unlock hard mode. Ow, I was dumb. I was dumb. Okay, underwater. There's another Alistair. Go to the right. We have an Iron Golem who punches down. Just wanted to grab that high lined up. And here it is! Shadow Knight! Well, that took a while. I mean, it, it was a lot longer than I thought it would be. Now we have 100% souls. Thank goodness it's done. I was actually calculating how many of those I'd end up fighting for my next level up. And of course, I think that's where we'd end up fighting the Demon Lord. Oh, and because uh, we don't really need to worry about it... Uh, do I want to keep hunt Headhunter on? I think I'll switch to Succubus and get the Dracula combo going. You know, regenerate our health as we attack. That's gotta help us survive here, right? Oh yeah, here's another one of these. Just saying it. 
Why? Why you gotta do me like that? Yeah, of course it would be a mimic there. Ah. Uh, anyway. Doesn't, doesn't the Shadow Knight look kind of like Terra? Like, the helmet just look... Just reminds me of Terra's helmet from uh, Kingdom Hearts. Well, doesn't that seem like an ominous door? At least we have an excellent save spot, so let's get ourselves properly geared up with Headhunter. And instead of the Soul Eater Ring, we grab the Satan Ring. Flame Soleil is good, right? Uh, Flame Demon Giant Bat Headhunter, I think... Yeah, Flame Demon should be good. Actually, no, I have a better option. Uh, where is it, where is it, where is it, where is it? I never got to show it off. And I mean, I'm gonna have two bonus episodes where I just show off all of these. There it is. So, yes. It is time for us to fight the final boss. And you know what? You know what? All that prep I did. I wanted. I want a challenge. Bring it on! I'm finally here. I wonder if I can do this alone. You're not alone. W what? Everyone remaining in the castle combined their powers to connect. Everyone remaining in the castle combined their powers to contact you. Does that mean they all know that I'm Dracula? Yes, Arikado told us everything. I bet they're all afraid of me. No, not at all. At first, we were shocked, but everyone believes you'll get through this. I'm going to send you a message from them now. Listen. You'll visit my shop again, won't you? I'll be waiting for you. Good morning, Soma. I just happened to hear... Good morning, Soma. I just heard about what happened to you. I told you this before. You are you. I told you this before. You are who you are. And you mustn't let him win. For the man who beat me. Don't disappoint me now. This is your last chance. And ours as well. I'm counting on you. They're all rooting for me. You can do it, because I believe in you. Mina. All right, here I go. Bip. There's a reason I'm doing this, so that we don't have that over again. Q a la card what? So. Eh, 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 eh. I can do this. I can totally do this. So yes, we've had our souls taken from us and we need to break them out of these. And each of the, the portions of chaos are attacking with a type of soul that just is how it is. So now we've reclaimed our... Wow. I'm doing a lot better at this than I thought I would be. Okay, what the hell? I went through phase one just kind of with reckless abandon. Just... <laughs> I was not supposed to live to this point. And I don't care. Because honestly, I do just want to, you know, get to this point. Sorry I kept you waiting. Time to keep that promise I made you. 
And we get a Symphony of the Night moment. There's the bad ending. Now, if I just... pull back to here... That never happened. And what was it again? Giant bat. Because what else am I going to have there? Oh yeah, the only soul we haven't had sealed is our... Ah, uh, sorry. The only type of soul we haven't had sealed. Well, I accidentally activated that, but that's fine. Uh, we haven't had our ability soul stolen. Or sealed. Which I guess is meant to reflect that... Soma is in full control. Anyway, yeah. It costs a lot to use, but the Minotaur's axe is just amazing. And there we go, final boss defeated. We have become the master of our own destiny. And I mean, I, I would think this should stop the chain of, you know, rebirth for Dracula, because we just destroyed chaos itself. Hello, Soma. Congratulations. I've got another job that I must attend to, so I have to go now. When I heard that you were Dracula, I was shocked. I was also just waking up, you know. If you think about it, though, everything turned out okay. <laughs> I'll never forget your courage and your strength. And I haven't thanked you yet for rescuing me, so thanks. You're like a younger brother to me. It was fun, and I hope we meet again. Goodbye. Hey there. Much obliged for your business at my shop. Back at the castle, I realize my true calling. Fighting's just not for me. I think I'll quit the army and open up a shop any time I'm in the near future. Probably soon. I wonder if you can actually just quit the army like Hammer's doing. I'm pretty sure that would be desertion, but okay. Promise me you'll come. I'll give you a good deal. You fought well. When we fled the castle, I felt the power from Vampire Killer fading away. I don't know what that means, but I won't have to do anything for the time being. Farewell. May we meet again. The path you took was the most challenging one. The path you took was the most challenging one. You did well. For God to be good, evil is an absolute necessity in this world. In the future, someone may follow again in Dracula's dark footsteps. At that time, perhaps, we'll meet again. Farewell. In my mother's name, I send thanks to you. Wake up. Wake up. Wake... Wake up. Wake up, Soma. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, oh, my goodness. It feels like somebody took a wig and some colored contacts out. Soma. Oh, thank God. I was so worried about you. 
Arikado told me that you would be okay, but I was worried. I thought you would never wake up. I heard everybody's voices. You saved my life. Again. Again? Yes, I couldn't have won the last battle by myself. Everyone's kind words and encouragement led me to victory. You know, the whole strength of friendship deal. I'm so glad that your experience didn't change you. But it did change me. I'm a god now. I mean, that's essentially what Dracula was. In what way? I'm a lot cooler now. Yeah, you have changed. The old Soma would have never said that. Remember? Inside of me, Dracula's power lies sleeping. It may not be evil anymore, but it's definitely changed me. It's okay. If anything ever happens again, everyone will rush to your aid. That's right. I guess they will. Look, the eclipse has ended. Probably shouldn't have stared directly into it. That, that's probably why we had those hallucinations. Your kind words gave me the strength to win. Thanks. And there we go, the proper ending. Because, well, that's the canon ending. Because of, uh, Dawn of Sorrow being a, being a thing. So with that, I will say my final thoughts about this half of the game. Yep, there's a whole other half to go through. I mean, hard mode does add some changes. Souls are easier to collect by a small margin. There are special weapons and armor that are only in hard mode. You know, Death Sickle being one of them. And, of course... Well, hard mode is... That's a bit more difficult. I won't be doing a hard mode playthrough, though. I think a normal mode playthrough is enough. Especially since we've unlocked two modes. Boss Rush mode and Julius mode. So, if you ever thought, well, I just don't like Symphony of the Night style of play, if you can get your hands on an already completed copy of Ari of Sorrow, you'll have the ability to play as Julius Belmont from the beginning. And it plays pretty much like your standard Castlevania. Julius has access to sub-weapons, no souls or items drop, you can't heal anywhere outside of a save station, and the other bonus to Julius mode, you start with a lot of abilities right off the bat. And that's the other half of this Let's Play. I'm going to be playing through Julius mode. And Julius's game ends with Graham, specifically. It's not a what-if scenario where you get to play through the game. Oh yeah, you also unlock sound mode. Yeah. But there we go. We have a single save file, and we can go new game. Start a new game with data number one, while carrying over items and spirits. And we also have a boss rush time for this file. So, the total time it took to complete this game was 11 hours, 3 minutes, 53 seconds. Wow, considering how much backtracking I had to do, I'm surprised it wasn't longer. Same with the grind. The grind is definitely what took a lot of time. I mean, also the fact that I kind of was an idiot and forgot that I was playing on normal mode and thus didn't have access to a lot of amazing items. So yes, and, you know, hovering over a new game, it says enter Julius. You can enter... You can start a game with Julius. But for now, uh, I'll delete that third file. For now, I thank you all for coming down to my neck of the woods. I sincerely hope you've enjoyed this Let's Play of Castlevania Ari of Sorrow. Selma side. Have an excellent rest of your day, and farewell.